We are in the Louvre, sort of, or near the Louvre. And uh, there's a real fancy Starbucks. Check that out. And we are having a good time. We're going to be doing some more walking about, checking out the actual museum. I'm super excited about this. Uh, here we go. And of course, as with anything else, there's a queue. A lovely, lovely queue. Marriage de... Check out the sweet inverted glass pyramid. Some white noise from the man. That is super neat. <laughs> the Apple Store. All right, more when we get in. We're just gonna wait in line for now. Later. All right, we are back. We're in the Louvre, and it is super bright. But check it out, I got a sweet spiral staircase. We're in the, uh, this is the museum entrance. All right, here we go, going in, going in. Oh man, it's so awesome here. Beautiful, beautiful. Hey look, a 3DS ad. That's fun. <laughs> yeah, I think all these sweet 3D printed things. Right there, you got the uh, 3D printed Venus de Milo. Super awesome. We're going to get our tickets and we're going to head in. Woo! Alright, we're actually inside now. And so check this out, right? They use 3DS's for their um, audio tour, which I'm actually really excited about. I think that that's very cool. We're here to check out some sculptures and things. Look at this stuff, dude. This is a beautiful, Beautiful sculptures. I'll be checking in and uh, you know around the descent de croix. Croix? How do you say that? I forget. We're gonna we're gonna showcase some of the more famous ones or ones that I think are particularly interesting. But for now, we're just taking a look. We're doing some generalized views here. Uh, to check it out. <sighs> cool, cool. Anyway, here we go. We'll be back, I'm sure, in a bit, in a bit, in a bit. Neat. Some alien sculptures. This is Benedetto uh, de Mayano. Wow. That is some incredible. 
incredible stonework. Look at that detail, man. Isn't that craziness? Craziness. The tumble. The fun stuff. Man, that is, uh, look at how old this stuff is. Circa 1171 for that one. I am just so impressed with this stuff. Look at that, man. It's all painted up and everything. This is, uh, Andrea de la Robia, the Ascension of Christ. Look at <laughs> the feet. There's feet that are coming out of the little, like, curtains or whatever. Some kind of saint or St. Bonaventure is the question mark. This is an ancient birdhouse. No, just kidding. There's a hole in it though, like it could be one. Tabernacle. Eucharistic. It's the Eucharist, it's the Eucharist birdhouse. How oh, very cool. We're working our way through. Uh, there's a lot of open display cases. Uh, oh, here we go. This is some interesting stonework right here. With the pierced, all the piercings and everything. This was done by Someone, someone named Ron. <laughs> A lot of crucifixes and Virgin Mary, and this is super cool, man. Super cool. More, more sculptures. We'll be back when there's something else of particular interest. Welcome back, welcome back. We got some more of this cool artwork. This dude has an axe and a church. St. Wolfgang. He used metal. <laughs> Super. Like he got dragged across concrete a bit. Little degradation of the stonework. That sucks. This is somebody. I am really digging this. Jesus on a donkey. Cool. They didn't give him, this is a little bit of a strange thing, they did not give him a mustache. I wonder why that is. A lot of Christian sculpture. I believe this is Eve, if I'm not mistaken. No, St. Mary, Mary, Mary Magdalene, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Trying to hustle through some of this stuff. It's all pretty, it's all very incredibly done, but I don't, not all of it's hyper relevant. It has a sword. That's pretty metal. A 
Actually, that's is that stone. Decapi. Yeah, that's stone. Or wood. Some kind of carving. Carving this. Adam and Eve. Nakedity. Do they? S oh, that's yeah, that was cracked in half, and they sealed it with some kind of similarly colored mortar. That's what it looks like. Imagine the time it would have taken to sculpt all this stuff at this level of detail. Look at that. That's incredible. And remarkably intact for what it is. This is uh, I don't know what year it's from, but it's cool. It's not really super specific about the year. This artwork is very good. We'll be getting to, this, to the different paintings and sculptures and stuff uh, in a little bit. Is that wood? That's wood carved? Check that out. That's time consuming. Looks like uh, ants or something. Social tree type folks. All right, anyway, we'll be back.